Hey everybody, welcome to another Hearthstone video. Today, like usual, we're going to be opening some packs, and then depending on what we get, we're going to try to build a deck around it. If I have to play another deck, that's fine. But yeah, let's go ahead and open these 23 packs. So yeah, let's see what we get. A <laughs> legendary already, Harrison Jones. Honestly, like, it's a good legendary. It's a default, so I'll be able to use it at any time with any class. But it is not one of the good ones, but it is cool to have. So I'm okay with that. Okay, a golden of a card that I do like, so that's good. Alright, so looks like our default packs gave us a little bit of luck. I guess we'll see how... Our Ungoro packs do. But yeah, that was a good start. It was a good start. And yeah, from here, I'm kind of just hoping. I'm not even hoping for legendaries. Just kind of the cards. I need all of them in general. That's a good card to have that I don't think I have yet. And then I pretty much have all of these, but all of those are pretty much good cards. Nothing too good. Though I wouldn't mind maybe a quest. We have one quest, and that was the that's the hunter quest, but it's the most garbage out of all of them, so. I wouldn't mind another one of those. But I don't mind these random cards. I mean most of these are used in a deck anyway, so I need them. That's why I'm not too too, too salty whenever we don't get a legendary. But I would like one though. <gasps> Another legendary. Ooh, yes. The mage legend. The mage quest. We are gonna play a deck. I I know a deck inside of my brain. I know a deck that we will use for that. We'll see if I have all the cards for it, but I'm pretty sure we do. So I'm actually excited about that. Mage is one of my favorite classes to play. Because it can be one of the most annoying. And today we've had two legendaries so far. Usually, if you watch my old videos, I get usually one or... Like, well, okay. I get usually one legendary. So having two, I'm... I'm very happy with that. We'll see. Maybe we can pull out a third. Dare I say. Dare I say we pull a third. But yeah, I'm happy with those two. The Mage Legendary is not that... Or Quest is not that bad. And Harrison Jones, like, I don't need him. But he can be used in a lot of decks, so... Two epics. Okay, I like both of those. Last one. An epic okay that's a good card too all right so that is our 23 packs what i'm gonna do now since we got that mage quest we're definitely gonna be playing a mage game let me go search up the deck that i need and go ahead and make it real quick okay so i have made this deck and i'll kind of explain it to you because it does take a little bit of thinking to know about it and if you notice so we have our new quest open the gate the way gate open the gate open the way gate um, and we have Archmage Antonidas. This was like one of my first legendaries. I think I opened it on camera too. So what you're going to want to do is take some of your apprentices, Molten Reflection them. So now you have four apprentices. And with an Archmage Ant Antonidas, you put any spell down and your fireballs cost zero. So you could pretty much fireball them down. And of course, the open way gate gives you an extra turn to do so. Alright, let's get started with a game. Jaina. 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 Now, I do gotta warn you, I've lost like seven before this. It is on. So I'm a little bit tilted. Okay, we're gonna get rid of... We're gonna keep Frostbolt. If he plays something early on, like a worm... Okay, this is really good. We have draw... We have early clear, and we have the Kabbalist Tome, which gets us, r which 
gets us close. Closer to the... To the time warp. Now, I really don't want to frostbolt that, but I might have to. Or I might have to ping two turns in a row. Or I could play Volcanic Potion. I think what I'll do... Archaeologist, that's a, that's a really good draw. That's a good draw. That takes care of that. And it gets value from drawing the secrets because... If the secrets aren't on the deck, I don't get any value. Okay, that's even better value. He wasted a Frostbolt on it, so that's really good. Now, I'm really debating on whether I should Frostbolt it back. I don't think so. I think, I think we're good. What we'll do is we'll hit ping. Um, okay, well, you know what? Maybe we should have used the Frostbolt. I guess we'll see. I mean, it doesn't really do much. It does a little bit of damage, but we're playing for the long game anyway. And my barriers, it's like one one damage. It's not going to do much to me. So I think... Let's see what we get out of the glyph. Oh, that's not good. Hmm. Ice block. We need to make sure to use this ice block right here. Next turn. Actually, what we need to do. Next turn, I want to use the Cabal Tome. And I don't want to burn up any cards. So, I'm, I could have pinged that. But that would have kept an extra card in my hand. And I really don't need that right now. He's getting so much value from that card. It's actually insane. I mean, like I guess it's good that I didn't give him an ice block. Now, please don't tell me he has another one of those. Oh, that's really good. We can... I can give him a volcanic potion because that won't help him, actually. That's really good for us. Yeah, go ahead. Just take your volcanic potions. That doesn't do anything. Yeah, that doesn't help him in any way. So, uh, yeah, I need to, like, clear my hand a little bit, though, because I need to prepare myself for the tome. Really don't want to be burning up cards here. Do -do -do, do -do 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 -do. I wonder what that is. It's a good thing I didn't use tome. What could that card be? Is that counter spell? Antonitis. Okay, how many cards do we have? Eight... Hmm. Let's see what that... Okay, so it's not... Hmm. Do we have an ice block already up? You know, we can pretty much just pass this turn then. Yeah, we don't need to do anything. And yeah, um, I, I really would want to get this off early, but considering we're playing such a slow game, I'm actually not too worried about it. I guess we'll play Frostbolt, Ping. Hmm. I guess pass for next turn. I would, I would have loved if we would have four mana and I, I could ping out the tome. But again, I'm not as worried right now. What is he doing? Oh, he's a Cthun mage, huh? It's interesting. So, it seems like now, all of a sudden, he's want to be playing the fast game. Guess let's use this. That's not bad. Wait, how many? Eight. Eight. We have nine. Okay, so we won't burn up a card. Yeah, we won't burn up a card. So, that's good. And then we'll, we'll pretty much be able to... Okay, this is good. This is good. This ain't bad, actually. Another... Our next Cabal Tome. Let's see. What are we going to use here? I kind of need to get rid of my stuff, right? 
Hmm. And I don't want to use the cold light oracle. That will screw me up pretty bad. What to do? What to do? I guess we can just use this. Get it out of our hand a little bit. And then next turn we won't burn up a card either. Oh wait. Oh wait, 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 wait. Yeah, we won't burn up a card. We won't burn up a card. This will only give me one. Okay, and that's good because I'll be able to use it right away. And that didn't start out of my deck either, so that gives me another thing for the time warp. So that's good. That is good. So we'll get that out of the way. I think we're gonna have to go ahead and like just play our cards here. So I'm gonna have to play that. Play our Frost Nova. Play our Primordial Glyph. Another Kabbalist Tome. That's good. Hmm. So we'll take that. Now the only problem is I have my next card gets burned up. My next card. I if this card burns up and it's something vital, it's over. Babbling book. That's perfect. I don't care if that gets destroyed. So we're going to have to empty our hand here. I have to empty my hand. I have to keep my hand clear. Because I need to make sure I grab these cards that I need. For the... For the... No, I am not your master. Okay. Another fireball. Okay, come on. Give me the cards that I need. They're, okay, so that's one of the cards. It's good. It's progress. Uh, I don't know what to do here. I guess we draw our cards. Mana bind. Okay, you know what? He can draw cards, whatever. That's good. That's one of the cards that we need. And the novice engineer. Okay. Red identity, that's fine. Do we win? That... No. Wait. No, we need them... No we need another Molten. This is good. Let's see what we get from Cabal Tome. Wait, how many cards do we have? Pretty much have a full hand, right? Time runs out on me. We gotta clear some things out of our hand. Cone. Freeze a cone. I'm hoping we don't burn up our... Our molten. The second we get that molten, we win. I just really gotta not burn it up here. Pretty much... My main problem this entire game has been not burning stuff up. I. But let's just say it does get. We could get it from the Kabbalist Tome. But. Oh, does he not pop the block? He doesn't. He doesn't even pop the block. That's really good for me. My hand is too full. Arcanaut, that's perfect. That's perfect. Wait, how many cards do we have? Okay, I need to not... So here, we'll do this. That's fine. Okay. I need... Draw two cards. I need it, I need it to be my Arc Apprentice. Oh, Doomsayer is good. Doomsayer is good. I need my apprentice. He can't kill me because I have frost ice block up. I need my apprentice. I really need my apprentice. 
I also kind of need him to proc my ice block because I need to use my ice block in my hand. I pretty much this this game's in the bag, I'm pretty sure. That destroys his hand too. I we might be able to win already. Okay, so let's use babbling book. So let's play that. How many cards do we have? Eight. Eight. Okay. Come on. Give me give me my apprentice. Are you kidding me? Darn it, man. I need this to be something very small. Okay. Okay, I, I can draw a card next turn. And it dude, it has to be my apprentice. It has to be. Can I light your fire? That's fine. This guy doesn't know it, but we pretty much won. I if he if he concedes, I'll be mad because I didn't get the combo off. I really need him not to concede. I don't think he will though. With my low health, he won't want to. So that's good. I guess three. We have eight, eight, nine. Let's draw up some cards so he feels confident. Where's my? I have both apprentices. Oh, I needed my molten. That's what I needed. Okay. Wait a minute. Do I lose? No, I don't lose. I don't lose. I was gonna be scared. If he procs my ice block, the fatigue will kill me. I... The thing is, I need him to attack my face. I... This barrier needs to be procced. I don't win unless he attacks my face. Yes, yes, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. Yes, that... G I win. Yeah. If, as long as he doesn't leave me with one health, I win. Yes, that's GG, I win. That is GG. And what we do, get another one going, get another one going, and then time warp. But yeah, that was the deck. That's the main concept is you get your Moltens, you get your Apprentices, you Molten your Apprentices, and then everything's pretty much a cost of zero. Put your Antonidas down, get some spell that costs real zero, get your Fireball started, and then you shoot them in the face a whole lot. So guys, thanks for watching. I liked this video. I liked this deck. It's lot of fun i might play it after this video guys if you did enjoy it, make sure to like and comment as a personal channel and i'll see you guys later god bless and goodbye